You tell us it's going to be a good day when you wake up in the afternoon. Okay. Um, today's plans. Ah, uh, I'm actually not sure what today's plans are. I walked up. I, I got up. Because that's what I do. People rise so then they can, uh, do spins. Wee! Spins. Okay, I'm going to leave now. Shit. There's a certain amount of stupid that you must pass to make my jaw drop. Whoever created this game called Keyboard Mash successfully did that. I will show you what is the matter with the internet as of right now. This is a game called Keyboard Mash. What you do is click in the text box and type as many keys as possible until uh, 20 seconds ends. So basically this is how it works. As you see, the game has a certain amount of skill that you must surpass to succeed in doing this game. As you're seeing, I am not actually typing any real letters here. Um, I am about to hit 300. Yes, there you go. 5, 3, 2, 1. And then I'm done. Let's see what I got. I got... Um, it's loading now. Okay, I got... Um, 397 buttons pressed in 20 seconds, so lucky me. Unfortunately, I find this somewhat amusing, so I'm going to keep doing it until I hit 400. I hit 433. Now on to another thing. This game is called Keyboard Smash, which is ultimately a completely different um, type of game than Keyboard Mash. In, in fact, it's literally the exact same thing, only it has 10 seconds in, instead of 20. So let's see what I can do. Okay. Random letters. Good. Skill. This makes me sad. I just adjusted the brightness. I, okay, that that is odd. This is really weird. I hit 300 characters, so it adds an extra 10 seconds to the clock. Um, that is honestly a demotivator for me, um, considering, okay, I got 520 there, that, that is in 15 seconds, uh, I mean, 20. What's 10 plus 10? That's 20. Now I'm gonna try to adjust the screenness of my bright, adjust the brightness of my screen, <laughs> because I messed it up. Okay, I'm done screwing around, it's time to clean up the house. And I'm done! Now it's time for some extreme guitar playing. And I'm done! Now for a tour of the house! Well, there is a top third floor of the house, but no one ever uses it, so let's skip straight to going down the stairs. Woohee! Woohoo! Wah! Okay, and then we go around here into the main room. Main room! Yay! Haha! Kitchen! Woohoo! And then. We go in here, and there is a green screen there. We're moving in here. This is my room slash office, and uh, here's the office. Here's the entertainment room bit. So that's it. And then we're moving along the hall. Haha, <laughs> yeah, hall. And then, look at this. Here's the studio. I have drums, I have guitars, I have complicated amp stacks. And now that is done. So, we have an extra staircase here. This is how light switch works, and we walk down, this is how feet work. Okay, now, this bottom floor is a floor with a building structure. Hooray, bottom floor, woohoo, yay, for the bottom floor. Then there's some stairs, and then that's the house. I have literally purchased a copy of Knocked Up over ten times. And the DVD has never been successful enough to reach the end of the movie. I am now on iTunes, and I'm about to rent it out. And I'll let you know how far I get before there is a problem with the viewing experience that I may undergo. Considering that I think the director has actually put a little glitch in every single disc to make it enable for me to um, partake in viewing this movie. Um, they've made a lot more money off of me than probably everybody else combined, and now I'm going to give them, uh, four dollars more. Oh, I have pizza! Where did that come from? You have got to be bloody kidding me. Ah, uh, blah. I feel so blah. 
you know, blah, like, it's, it's almost an emotion, like, it's just one of those feelings that you get, you just don't want to do anything, you just want to sit on your couch and, like, just watch TV, but I don't actually have TV service in here, as of right now, like, that doesn't go anywhere, so, um, basically, I've been watching my subscriptions, and that's as far as I've been getting, um, but yeah, I feel like Blair is something that there should be medication for. Like, just Blair medicine to make you less Blair. So, anyway, um, this is the Blair song. For this segment, it requires concert lights. About to activate concert lights. Mm. Mm mm. Aye. Aye. I wasn't gonna get anything done today, that's why I didn't really try. I just sat down and watched Flood of the Conco on season two. But then, look, that was of my intentions, but I didn't actually do it because I forgot to open the case for the DVD. Yeah, that little protective seal is stuck onto it still because I haven't got rid of it. I don't see the point of it I mean, really, what is the rate of DVD thefts When there are sites like LimeWire When, why would you actually go through the habit of I'm simply mind blown by The illogicalness of that I'm getting sidetracked That is a side effect of being blah <laughs> oh no, I did the wrong chord. This is G, and this is F, but I meant to go C, and then A minor, but I said G, but I was meant to go C. That was my song. Go back to normal lighting in 3, 2, 1. Fantastic. I want some orange juice. Good. Ah. Ah. I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> <laughs>